Hi everyone, my name is Sam, and this is Today in History. Today is Saturday, November the 9th, the 314th day of 2024. There are 52 days left in the year. On this day in 1799, the coup of 1819, Brumaire, began in Paris, marking Napoleon's rise to power in the end of the French Revolution. On this day in 1877, Indian poet and philosopher, Sir Mohammed Iqbal, who was known for his influential efforts to direct his fellow Muslims toward the establishment of a separate Muslim state, an inspiration that was eventually seized by the country of Pakistan, was born in Sialkul, India, now in Pakistan. On this day in 1888, Jack the Ripper's infamous killing spree in the West Chapel district of London's East End came to an end. On this day in 1922, American singer and film actress Dorothy Danbridge, the first black woman to be nominated for an Academy Award for Best Actress, was born, also on this day in 1922. Albert Einstein was named the winner of the 1921 Nobel Prize for Physics for his explanation of the photoelectric effect. The Nobel Committee had delayed awarding the 1921 Physics Prize until 1922. On this day in 1923, Alice Coachman, the first African-American woman to win an Olympic gold medal, was born. Also on this day in 1923, the Beer Hall Putsch, led by Adolf Hitler, ended after 16 Nazis were killed on a march toward the Marienplatz in the center of Munich, Germany. On this day in 1938, beginning on this night, called Kristallnacht, Crystal Night or Night of Broken Glass, some 48 hours of Nazi-orchestrated anti-Jewish violence erupted throughout Germany and Austria, resulting in the destruction and vandalism of synagogues and Jewish businesses and the death of at least 91 Jews. On this day in 1943, the United Nations Relief and Rehabilitation Administration was created by a 44-nation agreement. On this day in 1953, Cambodia became independent from France. On this day in 1984, Wes Craven's A Nightmare on Elm Street was released in American theaters, introducing moviegoers to the villain Freddy Krueger. Considered a horror classic, it spun off a number of sequels. On this day in 1985, Garry Kasparov, who was 22 years old, defeated Anatoly Karpov to become the youngest male world chess champion. On this day in 1989, long a symbol of the Cold War, the Berlin Wall erected in 1961 and eventually extended 28 miles or 45 kilometers to divide the western and eastern sectors of Berlin was opened by the East German government. On this day in 1996, Evander Holyfield scored a technical knockout of Mike Tyson to win the heavyweight boxing championship for the third time. On this day in 2004, Swedish writer and activist Stig Larsson died from a heart attack in Stockholm. A year before, the girl with a dragon tattoo, the first installment of his internationally acclaimed Millennium series, was published. All right, everybody, that's it for today. Today is Saturday, November the 9th, the 314th day of 2024. There are 52 days left in the year.